freaking out. I just hope Aaron and the guys can fix the brake lines. I got other business to take care of, and I can't let them see me sweat. Got a guy that called me on an F-250 pickup. He's going to bring it over. If we can cut a deal, those guys are working, and I'm making cash in the front. Very cool. Good to see you, Joe. Yeah. How you uh, doing, Richard? So you finally decided to part with it, or what? Yeah, I, I really figured I couldn't do with it what I wanted to do with it. Why do you do anything with this? It's freaking cool. So what's the deal? I, I don't remember the story about the, why you ended up with it. Well, I bought it from a friend of mine to fix it up. I want to put power steering in it, you know, put some nice aluminum wheels on it, put an air conditioning unit in it. Truck's 1967 Ford F-250 Camper Special. I've had it about four years. I did a little work on it, and it's set for another year. So uh, after seeing it set, my wife really wanted to get it moved on, and I've got other things I want to do, and it's sort of just starting to get in the way. Ford's all-new 1967 F-250 pickups, well, they were built to be tougher, smoother, and a pleasure to drive. Millions of Americans fell in love with the F-250 because it rode more like a car than a truck. Let's check out the motor compartment. Ooh, just super stock and sanitary. This is a good example of what I like to get here at Gas Monkey Garage. Untouched, virgin sheet metal, all original, just taking care of all its life. 